Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. This is a bonus video. I love looking at small things. I find great inspiration in them. As I was looking for inspiration for this month's sticker pack, there was a mighty little warrior that I wanted to feature, but they're pretty shy. So I had to make friends with them first and What's the way to any warrior's hearts is through you make them hummingbird food. <laughs> In the past, our hummingbirds have always been super feisty and overly protective of their hummingbird feeder. So we usually only have one or two hummingbirds, but for some reason that changed this year and we have so many hummingbirds. Like before, we would refill the hummingbird feeder maybe once or twice a week. Now it's daily because there are so many, which made it for some really fun footage and filming of these little, I don't know, they're like ninjas with wings hyped up on sugar. I literally am like three inches away from the hummingbird feeder with my camera, just standing still and they are buzzing all around my head and looking at my hair and I could feel it on my face. They're so cute. And as long as I, you know, remained relatively quiet and didn't move, they were perfectly fine with me being uh, so close to them. This guy is my favorite. We call him the Red Baron and he has a distinct sound to his flying. It's a little bit more high pitched than our other hummingbirds. I say he needs a tune up, but I always know his character and he is like super spicy. He doesn't let anyone near his food. So he's the tiniest one too which is pretty cute. Now, before I jumped into creating my actual stickers, I wanted to sketch out my hummingbirds. I actually did a video back in 2014, maybe, maybe even earlier than that, how to draw a hummingbird. So I go into a lot more detail in that if you're wanting to be able to draw your own hummingbirds. And I'll leave a link to that video at the end of this video. Pretty much the same setup. It's just breaking things down into simple shapes. Really, I figured out how to draw hummingbirds by watching the animator. I animated the hummingbird friend of Pocahontas in Disney's Pocahontas. I'd watch him draw it and that's how I learned. So just the little, the, the head is kind of what leads the hummingbird along. Now some hummingbirds are much smaller than others so your, their body shapes are going to be a little bit smaller, some are a little bit bigger, but they're all just so stinking adorably cute. When you get to the wings there's a lot of variances you can do. Whether you want them to actually be perching, which I found is a rare thing that a hummingbird will actually sit and perch. I mean I've seen it, but most often they like to be moving. But when they do perch you kind of don't see the wings even like in the body. Maybe at the very tips you'll see them sticking out, but everything just folds down so perfectly. And then when they're flying, uh, even just giving action lines to how their wings are moving instead of going into the detail of it, um, sometimes I go with that. But I did a whole bunch of sketches and I thought I would have this done for the 1st of April, but April Fool's on me. There was a couple of things I wanted to fix on it and another additional design I wanted to add to the sticker pack before I jumped on. So I actually am a day late, but I think it was well worth it. Don't rush the process until you really, really like something. The other element that I wanted to include in the sticker pack was um, one of my favorite flowers, which is the cherry blossom. And we have a couple of cherry blossom trees that are near where I live and Three of them bloom really fast and they bloom really early. So usually storms take their blossoms even before they're fully bloomed. But we have this other tree that just looks dead almost the entire year, except when it blooms and it just is beautiful. So I went and took some footage, rainy footage, but footage nonetheless. So with my inspiration in hand, went about sketching out my hummingbird sticker pack, which, you know, in the past I've done like cute marshmallow themes and I did corgis and I did fairies so this is more of a flower bird combo. Now for those of you who don't know every single month this year I am featuring a different 
sticker pack on my Etsy shop. It's kind of a challenge for myself as I design different stickers, but they're exclusive to that month. I love the color scheme with this one. I love the addition of just the individual little cherry blossoms. And then the other addition I put was the hummingbird feeder, which is based off of one of our hummingbird feeders, which I really, really like. So here is the sticker pack. I hope you like it. I hope you enjoyed the footage of my hummingbirds. If you want information on getting the sticker pack or subscribing to my channel, anything like that, all the links are in the description box below. But thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. God bless you guys, and we'll see you in another art video. Bye!